morning, Bumblebeezies. Happy Wednesday. Today's Wednesday already? Yes. That was fast, you guys. Um, but it's Wednesday. It is 9 o'clock right now. We're going to make some coffee. I have this little bit of leftover from the last batch, and then I brewed more. So we're just going to add ice and then add more coffee. So I brewed another pot of coffee and do you guys remember how I said like whenever I would brew 12 cups the grounds would get all over the the coffee machine like the lid part I'll show you what I mean but I got some new filters because I had a feeling it might have been the filters and so I used I made the coffee with the new filters and it did not make a mess it was like perfectly fine but I um I did 10 cups I didn't do 12 and so I'm going to try it with 12 and see if it still doesn't make a mess. But I'm pretty sure it was because of the filters. Because I was using these like brown filters, natural basket filters that I got at Winko. This is the Winko brand. So I decided to get this one. Because I used to use this brand with my other coffee machine. It didn't use this shape of filter. It used like the cone one. But it was like this brand and I never had a problem with it. So let me show you guys what I mean. I actually still have the grounds in here, but like the grounds would get all over this part and just all around like the sides and it would just be a big mess. And I hated having to clean that. So I'm happy that this worked. Hallie, your bone is over here. All right guys, let's finish making our coffee. I have my heavy cream. Add a tablespoon of that. And then let's do brown sugar cinnamon today. Actually, you know what? Let's try the white chocolate mocha. I have not tried this one yet. Let's try this one, white chocolate mocha. Hopefully I like it. We're doing a tablespoon of that as well. Let's give it a try. Mm. Actually, I forgot that my other coffee... So you know how I mixed like the, la the leftover coffee with the new coffee? That other coffee that I made, I added cinnamon to the grounds. And so this tastes like cinnamon. I like it though. It's really good. I don't know that it, if it tastes like white chocolate, but it's just good. Um, and I mostly get the cinnamon. The new br the new batch that I brewed, I didn't add cinnamon this time. I don't know why, actually. I think I just, like, forgot. I wasn't thinking about it. But I do like it with cinnamon. That's, like, my new thing now. Which is crazy, because I never even used to like cinnamon drinks. Crazy how our taste buds can change, huh? And for dinner tonight, we're having... I'm going to be making Kahlua pork in the slow cooker. So we're going to get that started. And then I'm also going to be making some of my mac salad. Okay, you want me to hold you like this? Yeah. I'm my sister.
Set it and forget it. Yummy. Usually after a while of him, like I let him feed himself with this, but he usually wishes it around and he does suck on it and he does eat some of it. But after a while, I'll just feed it to him just to, just so I know he's actually eating. Okay, do you want water? Good job. You okay? Good job. This is the new mug that I got um, on Monday at Disneyland. It's part of their new Discovery series. So this is the Disneyland mug. Super cute. I love that it's matte. The other ones are super glossy, and these ones are more matte. Maybe it's like not matte, but maybe, maybe it's a satin finish. I don't really know. And then the design is glossy. Would you consider this matte? Let me know. Okay, so that's a Disneyland one. It's pink on the inside. Here is the California Adventure one. It is like this tealish, mintish, I guess teal color on the inside, but it's really cute too. I like how they added like Marvel and Toy Story and... Oh look, there's a cookie num num. I never noticed that. And the cozy cones, cars, Carthay, Mr. Incredible. So yeah, I really like this. Oh, there's part of the carousel right there. And then I also got this one a while back, like maybe a month ago when we went to Disneyland. This is part of the old Been There series, but it is a new design. Why won't it focus? But you see how it's more glossy? It's the Arendelle, why won't you focus? Arendelle mug. Super cute too. And then this one is blue on the inside. So I need to reorganize the mug cabinet so I can um, add these to the collection. So this is like Sebastian's little play area setup. We got him this fold out like little kid couch on Amazon, but I, I don't like it because it never really like fully inflated because it came like, um, what do you call it? Like vacuum sealed and it was like all bent. And like when it, after 24 hours, they said it would like, you know, go back to its normal shape, but it's still kind of like messed up. So I'm going to return that and get him a different one. But this is like where we let him like sit and play with his toys and stuff. And then right now my living room is currently a mess. We have the swing here. I think we are going to get rid of the swing actually, because I was thinking of keeping it because it can go up to 30 pounds, but we used it yesterday and he just kept on trying to get out of it. So we're not going to put him in that anymore. So I think I'm going to sell it. And then the end tables, you notice they're not at the end of the couches because we are selling them as well. I decided to get rid of them because we need more storage in our living room. And these are just so big and bulky. Has the glass top. Um, it only has like the little drawer down here, which was fine before, you know, it was every was working fine for us. But now that we have Sebastian, we needed more storage. So I decided to get this instead which i love i got this at target i like it because it's slim and then obviously it has all the storage you do have to buy the bins separately but like now we can put his toys in here so at the end of the night when he you know when he goes to bed and we're cleaning up the living room then we just put all his toys back we have our lamp shade up there or our lamp up there and then these are just toys that he's too small for right now like his little Disney um, snack, what do you call this? Like a snack, 
Well, it's a wooden food counter. Then he has this uh, stroll and discover activity walker. Vanessa got him for Christmas. Then he has his little shopping cart. So I kind of just stuffed it in the corner for now. But I'm really liking this little setup right here because of number one storage and number two it doesn't take up a lot of space so i think eventually we're gonna have his little he has a playpen that we can put right here that way he's enclosed and stuff when he plays because right now he is crawling all over the place and he not really crawling but he like scoots backwards so we always have like pillows all around him but anyways i just wanted to give you guys that little update i'm still currently working on like decluttering and getting rid of stuff that we don't need and just reorganizing everything but we got that and then on the other side we got one too i'll show you so this is on the other side oh this is his bouncer that we're also going to be trying to sell or getting rid of because he definitely doesn't use that anymore and this side, we just got a smaller one because the space on this side wasn't that large, but this fits perfectly on this side. I just have our little, um, our ears on this side, our uh, bride and groom ears, and then lamp, so nothing else has changed there. On this side, we keep our games, and um, Callie's toys are in there, and then these are just games and stuff. So yeah, that's what it's looking like on this side. I'm gonna make some lunch. I'm basically gonna chop up some of this Polish sausage. And then I have some cabbage I already washed and chopped up yesterday. Um, we have a little bit of mushrooms that I wanna get rid of, so I'm gonna add that in as well. So let's just start by cutting up the sausage. I bought this at Costco. It's really good. It's the This is the brand and then it's Polish sausage. So I'm gonna do two. for eight hours i have it on warm right now because it's already done but it was on high for eight hours and we're just trying to keep it warm i'm gonna shred it but i'm gonna do it like oh you guys got a little facial um i'm gonna do it though like when we're about to eat dinner because aj's not home yet and it's not even five o'clock yet but look at this you guys oh my god i we tried it it's so good i think this one's better than last time because i made it in the oven last time I think this is like much better than cooking it in the oven. Here is the pork all shredded and ready to go. I already turned this off. Um, but yeah, that's ready to go. We have rice and then I also made mac salad. I forgot to buy carrots, so there's no carrots. 
Um, but yeah, it's still really good.